Good morning WRC. It's uh, April the 16th today and uh, 9 o'clock in the morning, Thursday. Beautiful day out there again, nice and sunny. And uh, yeah, looking forward to whatever the day brings. I'm still on holiday and um, I decided to take a break and I've been talking about taking a break over the last few days and why it's important to not just you know set a normal routine and work but also if you can take a break to decide on a routine to decide on a list of things that you're going to do and to do them day by day at the moment i'm working on my allotment so lots of digging uh lots of planting getting on there i've also got some repair work to do around the house so i've got that to look forward to as well and like I said, what I did is I sat down one day, I took out my notebook, I made a list of what I was going to do. And uh, yeah, just every day, just get on with it and do a little bit of work um, alongside with getting everything out. So I still wake up at a regular time. I still get myself ready. I um, still make sure that I've got, you know, uh, as you can see, I've brushed my hair, I've gotten dressed, you know, I'm not in my pyjamas. And uh, yeah, get on with it and get on with, with the day ahead. Now, there was something I was thinking about just the other day. And it's how there's so much terrible news about the uh, coronavirus. And, um, you know, what can we do about that? And to be honest, I think... One thing is not to spend so much time reading about all this news. That's the first thing. We know it's a bad situation. It can either get better or worse. At the moment, it's not going anywhere. It's getting worse, I think. OK, there you go. That's, that's what the situation is. We can ignore it and just get on with what we're trying to do. That's number one. But number two as well is to see all the good news that's happening. For example, there's a Captain, Captain Tom. He's uh, almost 100 years old. And on his birthday, he wants to walk for the NHS and he wants to raise some money. He's managed to raise almost 10 million pounds for the National Health Service. And uh, what he's doing is he's walking up and down the length of his garden at the back of his house every day to raise the money for charity. Wow, that, that is such a great piece of news. Better than all this terrible news about, you know, how many people are dying and how many people are suffering and so on and so forth. So take the good news, acknowledge that there is some bad news out there, but we're not going to pay attention to it. We're going to pay attention to the better things in life. And we're just going to get on with what we're trying to do with our lives. Set a daily routine, make a list of things that you have to do, and start doing them, okay? Whether it's cleaning out a section of your house, repairing something that needs repairing, or, um, you know, as in my case, doing some gardening, looking after the house plants. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Take care, all the best, and uh, stay safe and stay well. Bye-bye.